So I'd like to start off just by asking if you know anyone who's committed suicide. Yes. Uh, yes, I do know. And when you heard the news, how did that affect you? Um, it was kind of weird to think about um, how it affected like the family and stuff, so it was kind of difficult. What were your first thoughts when you heard this news? Uh, of course it's unfortunate, you know, no matter the circumstance. Uh, with suicide, I guess the first thing that goes through my head is, you know, why? And then the second question we have to ask is, what does mental health mean to you? Oh gosh, I don't know. <laughs> um, I think a lot of it comes from a support system, like having feeling like you have people who you can rely on um, to make sure that you're doing okay and like handling stress or like depression or whatever it may be well and people who look out for you I feel like it's a big So what does mental health mean to you? I think it's overlooked um, for sure. I think it's a big issue in the world. Uh, you know, there's a lot of people who are uh, disregarded because they think they're a lot of the society thinks their problems are, aren't fixable or they're just you know, nobody's business. So I think it's overlooked and something that we need to look more into. Okay. Our product, One Story, One Change, it's aimed to tackle the stigmas that's in the society. With the past treatments that has been implemented, a lot of times communities are overlooked. And with our product, an online open forum where people can share their experiences, connect with other individuals that have gone through the same thing that they have, will really bring that missing piece throughout their recovery, which is the aspect of community. We really believe that our product will help some of these individuals that are really, really looking for support from people when they don't have that kind of support within their physical community. And we believe that our impact will make a huge change in the world. At One Story, One Change, we plan to offer a subscription service available for purchase. We understand that many teens and even adults might not be able to fit this into their monthly budgets, which is why we plan to sell a group subscription to schools and companies across the country. Students and employees need a place where they can talk about their mental health without having to worry about people attacking them online. With our website, anyone will be able to post their stories online and our team will screen comments before they get posted to prevent unwanted hate. Not only can you post your story and read others, but there is a section of our website dedicated to online resources where you can read about conditions that you might have or even chat with an online mental health professional. Your story deserves to be heard. Visit osoc.weebly.com to learn more.